What's up YouTube? Now today I'm going to show you how to clean up a brass fuse. Now this works for any type of brass, not just fuses obviously. But um, this is the best way we've found and you can do it in about half an hour. Okay, step one is you get it in brick acid, which looks like this. You can get this from most um, commercial stores. It's uh, actually classed as brick cleaner. And uh, this one came from B&Q as it says on the label. And um, it's actually designed to clean um, bricks and concrete obviously but it works just as well on brass so the idea is you get this tub of brick acid you put some into a spare tub and then you take the fuse apart into its components and then you soak it in there for about 20 minutes there's none of this leaving it in for like a day or two I've seen it on loads and loads of internet forums where they go oh leave the fuse in acid for two days don't do that because that, that's not going to do it any good that's going to mess the fuse up if you get the brick acid or the brick cleaner leave it in for 20 minutes maximum and then take it out and wash it off with water because brick acid does burn the skin well it doesn't necessarily burn it but it makes it all go dried up and crack after a while so don't really touch it if you can but if you do just wash it off really quick um, but don't leave the fuse in it for very long, 20 minutes max. You can probably actually get away with leaving it in for 10 or 15. I normally leave it in for 20 just so it gets the added effects. So I'm going to do that now and then I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so now you've soaked them in brick cleaner for about 20 minutes. You'll notice they've gone a bit of an odd colour. Um, that's pretty normal. So the next step after you've soaked them is to just get some steel wool or wire wool and then go around the edges and completely polish the whole fuse so it comes a nice shiny shiny colour rather than the, the dull colour so dull, shiny, dull, shiny so after you've gone around the whole thing with steel wool it's pretty, going to be pretty clean and it really, it really doesn't take too long to be totally honest that's why you can do it in about half an hour, including the time it takes to soak and it really does make a difference.